Lauren, you must be excited, but I guess you've got mixed emotions the day of the pageant, right? Um, I'm not ne necessarily mixed emotions. I'm pretty sad about giving up the title of Miss America. It's been a year. I, I, it, it's so nice to have followed you and this, this, this year, and Thank all you. of a sudden you're, you're going to be going back to college, right? I am. I'm going to head back to Tulsa, Oklahoma. I'm going to keep traveling and speaking as a former Miss America, and then starting in the fall, I'm going to go back to school to study to be a high school music teacher. Boy, high school music teachers is a whole bunch different than I understand. I was reading in one of the magazines. Did you actually work with some undercover police people while you were uh, serving as Miss America? I did. I worked with John Walsh in America's Most Wanted. I uh, worked with them on a sting operation because my personal platform is Internet Safety for Kids, and that is also one of John Walsh's passions, the kids, of course. And so we worked together. Um, I went out to Long Island, New York, and caught four men the day that I was the uh, decoy at the sting house. You know, I, I have a radio show, and it, every day I'm hearing stories time and time again as to how many predators are out there. Did it blow you away? Absolutely. I mean, it's. I, I knew that it was a danger, and I knew that there was, you know, of course, predators out there. But, you know, it, we're just scratching the surface. You see shows all the time. You know, you see the To Catch a Predators. You see America's Most Wanted. But as many people as you see get caught on that show, there are so many more lurking out there. Oh, you've got so many things on your, uh, on your resume. You're also a Goodwill Ambassador, have been for the uh, Children's Miracle Network. Tell me about that. I have. A, that, you know, the way I work with Children's Miracle Network has been some of the most rewarding work that I've gotten to do. The kids are amazing. The families are great. The hospitals are absolutely spectacular. And uh, working with Children's Miracle Network has been wonderful. Okay, this, uh, the, the end of, of your reign, like you say, you'll continue to, to speak. But let's talk a little bit about the pageant, which is upcoming uh, just around the corner. Uh, TLC it's going to be on. And this year, we who are at home, who have access to a computer, we can actually partake and, and be a part of the pageant, right? Right. Actually, the American public gets to go on TLC.com backslash Miss America and vote for their favorite contestant. The judges here at Miss America will pick 15 contestants to be in the top 15, and then America's Choice will be the 16th contestant to recompete for the title of Miss America. You know, TLC has done a great job with the reality show, really um, trying to give Miss America a modern, very contemporary approach, also with sticking with our old traditions. Now, speaking of the old traditions, I, I just went online and Googled before we went on the air. The pageant goes back into the 20s when back then it was just a beauty contest, a bathing beauty contest, right? It was. Back in the 20s, it started in 1921 in Atlantic City Boardwalk as a bathing beauty contest. So, um, you know, we've definitely evolved as the, as the years have gone on. We've become a scholarship program. We've added talent. We've, you know, done a lot of really, really wonderful things. So we're just looking for all the next changes. Uh, I, I don't want to ask you if you have any favorites, but isn't there an amazing array of talent and, and beauty with these 50 women who will be uh, competing shortly? We do. We have, you know, every 52 contestant that shows up every year is a well-rounded, talented, well-educated, you know, poised, mature young woman. And so any one of them could be Miss America. We've got a great crop of girls this year, so it'll be interesting to see as the week progresses. You know, here in, uh, in Utah, we had the Shakespearean Festival. I was there for their fall uh, productions and the young lady who is Miss Utah mm -hmm. uh, actually performed on stage. Did you realize that she was a combat medic? I do, I do. That's a really neat thing. You know, we, we thank Jill for all that she's done with the military and, and all of her contributions to the world. Lauren, thank you so much and this is absolutely wonderful. Uh, good luck with the pageant. Good luck with your uh, uh, your, your college. Uh, it, boy, it must be a, a real radical change to go from Miss America back into and your college studies. We good luck to you, and of course, we'll all be tuned into uh, TLC you. Thank for the you. pageant. Thanks again. Bye bye. Uh -huh. Bye bye.